Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing the first module of 18 Math 41 super important questions. So I've included totally 7 questions but uh, along with the 7 questions there are few uh, like uh, 3 more topics okay. But I could not find any question in the mo uh, previous 2 model question paper and in the um, previous year paper okay February paper 2021. So I have not included those questions in this um, uh, question uh, bank but uh, the all the topics what could be asked in the exam all I have discussed in the uh, theory video which I have made the link can be found in the description box so you can uh, go through that video and uh, it means all the type I have covered okay in this video I will be just covering the hints of what are the questions and where are the answers present what you need to uh, write and how you need to approach uh, the question in the exam okay and this uh, link can be uh, uh, this PDF link also can be found in the description box. You can download it, and uh, the page numbers are given here. I'll be telling you which PDF I'm referring, and you can uh, refer that page number as well. Okay, so uh, you can either uh, download and refer the PDF, or you can uh, watch this video. I'll be explaining here also what all you need to uh, keep in mind. Okay, so before starting, if you like this video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because your support helps me make more videos like this. So if you want more videos, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel so let's get started uh, so this is the pdf which you can find here there's a folder called as 18 mat 41 and here's the pdf which i'm going to refer okay so um yeah so uh, let's get started the first question uh, is about um Derive the Cauchy Riemann equation in Cartesian form. Cartesian form was repeated two times, and so I've included this one, but, but polar form also was also asked once. Okay, so if you're done with K, uh, Cartesian form, you can do, do the polar form as well. Okay, so here I'll not be explaining how to derive the equations, all these things I've already explained in the uh, video. I'll be just explaining you what you need to write here. Okay, so if they ask you about the Cartesian form, go to page number five here. So the Cartesian form is starting from here, CR equation, and you uh, basically have to do these four uh, derivatives. Uh, um, equal del u by del x is equal to del v by del y and del v by del x is equal to minus del u by del y so we'll be starting the proof from here and uh, moving on further okay so finally you have to uh, prove these two things so that's all what is it there in the uh, Cartesian equation and the polar form also the same thing is there just that i and theta will be also there okay so moving on to the second question we have w is equal to f of z is equal to z plus e power z is analytic and hence find uh, dw by dz the point in mathematics is not regarding the uh, specific formula it's regarding the way you uh, way okay it's regarding the technique do you know the technique to solve this one that's the main question it's not that the question this same question will be asked in the exam no what guarantee you have that same question will be asked but if you know the technique any any question you can answer under the same technique right so make sure you know the technique this is the technique where you will be given with a function and um, it is analytic it is given hence find its deriva derivative you have to show it is analytic and find its derivative so uh, for each technique how you need to approach that I've explained in the uh, my original video which is uh, 18 minute 41 theory video so you can go and watch that okay in that i have explained how to solve any question under that uh, uh, means type of the question like for example in the module there are five uh, type of problems for each type of problem what you need to keep in what are the common things uh, you can find out and how you solve them that is the main thing what i am uh, trying to um, tell you here okay so that's the thing which you need to keep in mind so this answer can be found in the page number 18 but it is very hard to actually go and uh, read directly and understand so uh, i urge you to go and watch that video you'll understand what is happening here so uh, you'll get to know the concepts okay so that was about the uh, analytic function so it is analytic and hence find its derivative next type of question is verify the function is analytic see here it is show that it is analytic and hence find uh, dw by dz but here it is verify it is analytic okay we just have to verify and we have to find its derivative it's a quite similar uh, problem but it's slightly different so it's in page number 12 if you, if you go to page number 12 in this pdf you'll be getting the answer here <coughs> this is the answer okay this is the repeated question okay so this is regarding the polar form and the top one was uh, regarding the cartesian form so i've given uh, both type of question for you okay so next one is if uh, f of z is analytic they have given f of z is analytic show that this proof exists okay so this is, is in page number 13 so this is the proof okay along with that if you if you have done this proof equally important is the another proof which is uh, found in the next um 
theorem this also proof has been asked in the previous paper as well as in the model question paper okay so make sure you know these two proofs very well next type of question is construct the analytic function whose real part is given see either they can give the real part or the imaginary part you need to be very thorough with that okay so as many questions as you know that is uh, that, uh, that would be better for you okay if you go to page number 24 there you will find these type of questions where either the imaginary part will be given or the real part will be given and you are supposed to calculate the uh, u is equal to iv function okay that type of questions are here and another type of question is like they will be giving you u minus v is equal to something here they just give you u is equal to something right here they'll give u minus v is equal to something in that case how you'll find out that is in page number 27 okay this is in page number 27 u minus v is given to you and how you need to find out all the type of question i've already discussed watch that video you'll get to know how to solve each type of problem um whatever is there in the syllabus okay so coming to this question uh, which is show that analytic function with constant modulus is constant very important proof it's in found in page number 16 so if you go to page number 16 here we have the uh, proof for this one this is the theorem and this is the proof okay so basically this is all what i could discuss in this video yeah rest of the information you have to find out from the other video itself make sure you hit the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and uh, thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one